G'day, it's Terry from uh, Bushman's Craft. Um, tonight I'm doing a bit of a camp oven uh, cook up. Got some mates coming over, and as mates do, uh, especially in the bush, uh, camp oven comes to the fore. Um, camp oven's uh, a lot like barbecuing. Um, it seems to uh, be a bit of a, a male thing. They seem to uh, gravitate to it, and uh, they've, they've all got their recipes from doing stews to soups right up to desserts and that sort of thing. So uh, it's something that you'll see a lot of in the bush and a lot with the caravanners that travel around today. The dish that I'm putting together is very simple. Their taste that I like, a little bit different. It's a chicken dish with rice and, and um, uh, some lovely ginger and garlic taste and that sort of thing. So uh, quite easy, put it together. Uh, doesn't take a lot of cooking time in the Bidori. Uh, I've got my coals ready. Uh, I've even got the hot water on for doing the dishes later on. So I'll just quickly show you and put this together and we'll, we'll, get, it, uh, we'll get it underway. So first and foremost, I'm going to um, put the rice in. This is a jasmine rice. Obviously jasmine rice has uh, got a bit more aroma about it and the taste, which I love. Um, chicken stock um, in with all of that. So get all of that in there. The chicken stock. I like some peas in it, um, but this is the sort of dish that you can really um, you can really um, suit to your own taste. Um, garlic and uh, ginger. I just absolutely love ginger, so um, and the garlic adds adds to the taste. So that's all all in. It's in there. A um, little bit of chilli. A little bit of chilli adds a lovely little bit of heat to it. I don't like it over hot, but certainly a bit of chilli flakes in it. Now, the chicken. Uh, these are chicken thighs. I'll spread these around in the dish. Now, I've got a fair few here, but um, no worry. Um, there won't be many left after tonight, I tell you. So it's just re just arranged the chicken around the um, the dish itself, and that really is as simple as it gets. Um, just putting all that together. Now we'll cook this over the coals. Um, this might take 30 minutes, 40 minutes. I'll keep checking it so it doesn't dry out. But once the, the chicken's cooked, the rice is cooked, and the whole lot comes together, and all those flavours uh, come together. So we're going to put it over the um, I'll put the lid on it and we'll get it over the stove. Now I've got it set over the top of those coals. Um, there's quite a bit of a heat coming through there, but not sitting it in the coals is going to cook it. Um, just nice and gentle for it. I'll check it a few times. So um, obviously I've got to feed horses and dogs. Uh, all our animals eat before we do. So I'll head off, mix up some feeds and tend to those jobs. And then I'll come back and have a look, and then we can have a look at what um, uh, we've got as a result in the, the Vildori. Back to check on the, um, the camp oven. The horses are fed, the dog's fed, so um, it's about time that we had something to eat. So I've checked it a couple of times. It's come along really nice. Um, so we can get this off without burning ourselves. Oh yeah, that's nice. Yep. Rice is really nice and the, the chicken's done lovely. All this needs now is um, garnishing. So let's let's do a bit of garnishing on this. Um, not everyone loves uh, a bit of coriander, but um, I certainly do and it goes so well with this dish. So. I've got some really nice um, fresh coriander here. Um, so we'll chop up a bit of that. Yeah. And make sure a good, a lot of coriander. Uh, obviously, if you're not a fan of coriander, uh, there's plenty of other greens that will go nicely with this dish. So the coriander um, gives it a nice flavor. The spring onions, cutting long strings, bit of garnish, makes it look really good with the spring onions on. 
Right, uh, let's serve some up. Yeah, really nice. The, the rice will fluff up lovely. Um, if you want a bit more coriander. Now, I put some soya sauce on, but put it on for taste. But it just goes so well with this dish. So, so easy. A lovely dish to put together. So simple. Um, enjoy. Until next time, it's Huru from the Hut.